Hey YouTubers, it's that van guy again with another video. Today we're going to be doing a Hot Wheels casting spotlight of the Speedbox. The Hot Wheels casting name is Speedbox. Uh, this first one, uh, this white one here, is the first in the casting lineup. Uh, it was released in 2013 in the Hot Wheels City Rescue series in white. With chrome fenders. Get a closer look at it. It's got kind of a clear roof. So you can see into the interior. Kind of like a futuristic minivan. Kind of a cool one. Not the, not the most exciting van casting out there. But it's still van casting. And I, I'm a completist. So I like to collect them all. Uh, this one's pretty easy to collect. There's only six in the series so far. Let's take a look at the next one. This is the second release in the casting lineup. This was also released in 2013 in the Hot Wheels City Rescue series in yellow. Kind of reminds me of a school bus a little bit. It's yellow with dark chrome fenders. The next one is this blue one um, that was released in 2014 in the Hot Wheels Off-Road Stunt Circuit. And this is also a treasure hunt car. Take a look on the door there in front of the 95. You'll see the little Circle Flame logo. It's also on this side in front of the Ask for Stunt Team. And if you uh, know anything about treasure hunts, that little circle flame logo means it's a treasure hunt. And what I mean by treasure hunt, to give you an example, uh, Hot Wheels puts in each case of cars you send to the stores uh, some limited edition ones that are slightly different that are called treasure hunts. And I happen to have a different treasure hunt here so I could show you... Uh, what that means or what to look for a lot of times the, usually the card will have a number uh for the year it's like maybe they have 365 cars for the year and this is like 230 of the 365 there usually be a number up here on the treasure hunts and super treasure hunts there usually is no number uh also you can see on this bike you'll see the little flame logo that means it's a treasure hunt. It's also on the actual bike itself on the front, just behind the front wheel there. And another way to tell is if you read, see that little print? This I picked this bike because it's real easy to see it. Sometimes if it's a big, wide uh, vehicle, it's tight against the card. So you can't see the treasure hunt print on the card behind it. But I picked this one because it's real easy to read. I'll hold it up close so you can read it. Uh, it says, congratulations, this symbol means you just found a collectible treasure hunt car. Hopefully you can see that. I'll try to hold it up so that the camera can focus on it. Might be holding it too close. But yeah, if you take a look at the vehicle. I usually will have it on the vehicle somewhere, a little circle flame logo. Sometimes it has it on the card art. Uh, and then it always has this little message on the back of the card or on the, the front of the card behind the vehicle in between the, the bubble pack and the card itself. So if you can see in between the vehicle and the, the card, it has this little message letting you know it's a treasure hunt. This is uh, a 2018. This is street stealth. But just an example of what a treasure hunt is. For you guys and gals that don't know. Okay, back to it. Yeah, this is the only treasure hunt in the casting lineup. Again, it was 2014. And we'll take a look at the next one. 
This one was released in 2015 in the Hot Wheels Race Night Storm series in burnt orange with yellow fenders. And the wheels actually glow in the dark, these white wheels. So it's kind of a cool thing. Kind of reminds me of Ronald McDonald with the colors, though. Red, yellow, and orange. All right, let's take a look at the next one. This one, I like the paint scheme a little better on this one. This one is also released in the 2015 Hot Wheels Race Night Storm series. This one's a candy purple. Also has the glow-in-the-dark wheels. Uh, a lot nicer paint scheme on this one. I just like the colors better. Purple and pink. And then the last one in the casting lineup is this one. Uh, this was released in 2017 in a five pack called Fan Stands. This was a, a five pack exclusive, meaning the only way you can get this exact design was in the fan, the Fan Stands five pack in 2017. It wasn't sold in a single loose card like all the other main lines. The only way to get it is to buy the five pack. So this was released in 2017 and the, fi the fan stands five pack in red. So that's it. These are the six that are listed uh, so far in the casting lineup for the Hot Wheels speed box. So it's fairly easy to collect just six to collect so if you like to collect them all makes it a lot easier when it's a fairly new casting and there's not as many so that'll be it for this hot wheels casting spotlight thanks for watching if you enjoyed the video give it a like or a thumbs up uh feel free to subscribe also check out my facebook page that van guy where we talk about everything van die cast uh share pictures of your van collection, uh, van trading, and try to keep you updated on what's coming out or what's in the stores now. Uh, that'll be it for today's video, guys. Thanks a lot for watching. I appreciate it. You have a great day.